Good afternoon. Welcome to Lunch and Learn Zoom Friday. My name is Nancy Gaskins and on behalf of Olivia Vo and myself, we want to welcome you today and we'll go around the room first of all and meet our visitors. So Angela, I believe you were here last week and my first one to miss in a year. So I was feeling a little crazy that I wasn't with y'all last week. So go ahead, Angela. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Angela. I, I represent a company called Comla Tech. So what if you knew what the stock market was going to do before it actually happened? And that was right 74% of the time. Would that change the way you invest? Would it change the way you trade or even if you trade your own money or not? Um, I represent a system that does just that. And I'm looking for people who are interested in trying it out at 100% for free or people who are interested in trying it and sharing it and becoming one of our affiliates. So that is me and I, this is my second time. So if there's anyone new here, I don't know, cause it's only my second time. I love you guys so far. I've already reached out to Nancy and I'm like, what do I need to do? I need, because the, the energy is super cool. And last week when I introduced myself, I said, I always, um, worry that like I can't be a good human being and make a lot of money and everyone's like no no we don't we don't subscribe to that so I'm like yes you're my people you're my people so that's me thanks all right thank you Deborah welcome I was afraid you were going to ask me <laughs> <laughs> I uh have a business called the peer learning institute and the whole idea is that Employees don't leave organizations, they leave managers. And a lot of managers are promoted because they have technical expertise, they've got longevity, or they've had good sales. But that does not mean that they'll be a good manager. And so we use peer learning groups to help in-house to help managers develop the skills they need to deal with particular management challenges. Well, and so I'm here because uh, Balber, uh, Balbir uh, suggested that I come. Well, we're so glad you did. <clears throat> Excuse me. Deb, come on down. Hello, everyone. My name is Deb Ferrer. I'm just starting um, a travel service for dynamic female entrepreneurs over 40 who, want, who love to travel and have exceptional, extraordinary experiences so that they can enhance the quality of their life. And I'm excited to be here. I've already spoken to a few people. I'm looking forward to um, connecting with many more because like Angela said, uh, this is my kind of tribe, yeah. We're so glad that you're here. Thank Sandy. You. Nancy, good to see you again. Um, I and this is my second time visiting, and Nancy invited Nancy and Olivia. I guess I met them a few weeks ago during the conference, our, our a conference. Um, can you relate to this or know someone who is frustrated with not being consistent with their follow up, and they know the value um, that their valuable clients are falling through the cracks? I help entrepreneurs and small business owners create a simple, easy to manage follow up system to manage their heart, hot, warm, and um, want to work with lead list in a way that works for them. I am introducing a program called Trello into the lead management system and would love to talk with everybody here. All right. Thank you. Marta, welcome. Hi, so good to be with you all. Thank you too much, my friend Michelle Drake, for introducing me. Um, I'm an energy healer. I'm also a, a teacher of Reiki yoga, Kundalini yoga, Zumba, ecstatic dance, and basically bringing in whatever the person needs to help their human experience physically, mentally, emotionally, energetically, and like just create the best uh, experience for the person. And currently I'm busy working on guiding people on their own path of releasing like anything whatever blocks are coming up for them physically mentally emotionally often uh, patterns and behaviors that we may have taken on from our ancestors and just releasing all the blocks allowing your own light to shine and then live the best life possible and in doing what you are supposed to be doing in this beautiful um, life and um, so i'm helping people with that and also 
starting a group with coaches, healers, teachers, people who deal with a lot of people when they find that their energy is drained. So really just working on um, skills and tips through everything to keep their chakras aligned and keep their energy boosted and with the energy boost towards them every two weeks. So basically whatever people need, I'm very happy to be on this healing journey. I'm very happy to meet you all. Thank you. We're, we're glad you're here. Angelina, she has been with us a couple of times and she is keeping the light shining for our queen of green. So thank you, Angelina. You want to go ahead and introduce yourself? Hi, everybody. Um, my name is Angelina. I like to go by Angelina. And I am representing the Algae Grow product from the Bio Village Green um, Fertilizer, the Living Algae Fertilizer. And so I've always been working as a holistic wellness counselor and just looking to meet people who are interested in finding a way to integrate more relationship with starting with an indoor plant in your house if you want to start very simple or finding ways to get a garden going in your yard. And um, my biggest dream is uh, revolutionizing food systems here in starting in maybe starting local. I do a lot of work in our local community garden services. And so um, my dream is to really work with people who see that holistic wellness is many levels, starting with the awareness of our physical well-being and how we, how we take care of our body and how that relates to how we take care of the earth or maybe starting with taking care of the earth more and realizing how that impacts the wellness of your body. And there's many more levels to that, but to keep it simple, that's the main thing I'm hoping to connect with people on. Thank you. Thank, thank you. Did I miss any other visitors? Well, once again, we'd like to thank you. If you have not done so already, please drop your contact information, the best way to contact you in the chat below so that we can follow up. One of the things that I want you to know uh, about our group is we, we are a heart-centered group of entrepreneurs that we want to make an impact on this world. We are very ambitious, but our goal here is to help one another rise higher, go further, faster. And the way that we do that, we are a referral partnership tribe. And what that means is that is our number one goal is to help you grow your business. And we've got some new things. We're celebrating our one year anniversary in May. So we're very excited. Uh, lots of new changes on the horizon, but now it's time to get serious. And what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be really focusing on some ways to help you grow your business exponentially over the next 90 days. We're gonna be doing these 90 day runs and we're gonna be going through some of that today to help you do that. So if this sounds like something that you're interested in, like I said, we want to do good. We're philanthropists. We believe in giving back, whether that is our uh, time, treasure, talent, money, whatever that might be. We believe in that. Part of our funds go to philanthropy and um, we just love one another. This is relationship 101. Let me tell you what, we all love each other here. So if you're used to going into a networking group and just uh, taking, 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 we're not going to be your tribe. We want to get to know you. We want to be your friends. We do business with people that we like, know, and trust. Not everybody here is going to be your client or your customer, but 100% of us want to be your referral partner. And so in order to do that, we have to know more about you. So we, this is a gathering place where we come specifically to connect, partner, and profit. So don't feel bad. So um, we're going to go around the room quickly, and we're going to introduce a few members of our tribe. You never know who's going to be in here each week. We've got several hundred, but um, like I said, there's events going on, and, and you may see people coming in a little bit late. I don't mind that at all, but if you... Um, feel the need that you're going to uh, be distracted, please turn your camera off and, and go ahead and continue listening. But at this time, uh, we'll start with Claudio. Thank you, Nancy, and good morning or good afternoon, everyone, depending on where you are. 
Um, so what I do is I help busy entrepreneurs find that right passive income. Now, we all know as entrepreneurs, we love the concept of passive income. But we also know that it can be very time consuming to get one going and start generating some income. I can help you create one that really requires little to no effort. If you'd like to learn more information about it, feel free to reach out and I'd be happy to show you my results. Thank you. Thank you. Jess. The mute button and I are not friends today. <laughs> I saw a cup that I've got to get and I'm going to try and go on Amazon or get with Barb or something to make us one prize of the year. You're on mute. You're on mute. <laughs> well, I am on mute for a good reason and having trouble finding my button because literally how jealous of all of me uh, of me are all of you right as we speak my assistant is in my screen using my mouse and answering all my emails for me while I'm sitting here with you lovely people on zoom so I had to just pass the mouse with her so nana and a boo boo is all I had to say about that um <laughs> So I am um, a little crazy. What am I? I'm the Italian mother of seven. I am a, a sales and marketing consultant, a LinkedIn and social media trainer, uh, and I have a virtual assistant membership program. Are we doing celebrations or who I am? No, nope, who you are. 30 second intro. Okay. Well, I think that's it. I'm done. I'm amazing. You should talk to me later. Thanks. Okay. We'll get there. <laughs> Juanita. <laughs> Hello, how are you all today? So today I'm going to just let you know um, um, my new uh, little sidekick. So are you looking for that unique gift for a family celebration and thank you uh, to a client or a group gathering? The Boy Set Wine Collection can ship your wine gift directly to the party. So the 27 various vineyards that we have in Napa, California and France gives you a unique an exclusive wine choice, and they're not available in stores. So you could also join our quarterly wine club for an additional 20% off of your order. So this week I have a special to purchase any of our wine tasting selections, a red and white or a combination, or if you're all reds or all whites, 10% off at our link with promo code TASTINGS21. Since this is my new, I'll drop the link down but I thank you all because you guys encouraged me to step out of the box. So the Boy Set Wine Ambassador is on board. And folks, this is a way that you can add multiple streams of income to your business. She is has a travel company. And so that wine business went right married beautifully with what she's doing to give her an additional stream of income. So congratulations and, and way to go. Gary, come on down. Hi, do you or someone you know, are you frustrated with your career, dissatisfied with it, looking for something else? My name is Gary Sussborn. I'm a career ownership coach, and I'd love to help you find what possibilities are out there for you to take a look at. If you're interested, give me a call, put in the uh, text box or the chat box, hashtag own your career. Thank you. And Gary, I'm going to make a suggestion on your background there. I can't, I can't uh, see everything, but instead of find your possibilities, I would suggest that you put explore the possibilities or explore your possibilities. Just, just a little, uh, little tip. Rosemary. Thank you. Hello, everyone. Rosemary Giz here. Exactly what do I do? Well, I help entrepreneurial women. Women who actually want to achieve financial success and gain confidence around money conversations, to be able to explore for themselves exactly what they want to achieve their financial goals. And I do this through a customized step-by-step -step process that I take you through to help you achieve those financial goals. Thank you. Thank you. Kay? I had my mouse ready and then my computer <laughs> dinged me. <laughs> Darn. 
<clears throat> Good morning, everybody. I am Kay Lehman, and I am a health architect. And if you say, what in the world is a health architect? Well, just as homes have some things that are similar, but yet are unique in um, design, color, layout, um, our bodies and our lives are also unique in design and how we live, what we like, what we don't like, what we can, what we can't do, what fits, what doesn't fit. Um, and so I work with individuals to help them with where they're at and to begin adding action to their goals, to begin moving them in the direction that they need for their health. And I'll put my information in the chat. Okay, Bruce? Are you living your life to the fullest or just existing? Hi, my name is Bruce Barnes. I'm a mindset and wellness expert. I empower heart-centered people who want to improve their overall well-being and are ready to make the changes required to move towards their ideal life by using my courses, coaching programs, and technology that help you to actualize your full potential. Hashtag full potential. Okay. I want to say something right quick. Uh, Bruce, that was an outstanding elevator pitch. And uh, everybody, we need to work on our pitches. We started this group out as uh, that's what we did. And that's what we were known for. And I love the fact I wanted uh, you to listen. And I want you to go back and listen to Bruce's elevator pitch to figure out the combination that he used. Next week on our Lunch and Learn Zoom Friday, the whole session is going to be on practicing and perfecting our elevator pitches and our irresistible offers. So next week, I want you to bring your 30 second and I want you to practice. Marsha is the queen of keeping us on time and she has done a terrific job and we are way off the mark right now. So on that 30 second, notice that Bruce told us his name, what he did, how he did it, and then he had a call to action. We're out of practice and it's showing. And you guys know that I love you dearly and I want you to succeed, but we need to get back to the program. And we really, I know you're out there in these networking groups and you want to really have that message drilled down. I want you to have a 30 second pitch, a minute pitch, a minute and a half. And then we have guest speaker slots available for you to come in and practice your five minute and 10 minute presentations. This is critical for your success. And on that note, tomorrow, one of our cross-pollination partners is having an elevator pitch class that you're invited to. And I believe I put it in the uh, chat. I'll check. If not, I'll post it again on my Facebook. But it's a great way to, um, everybody has different techniques. And I brought in a couple of speakers for us to work. And we're going to pull that book back out because we're going to get that published over the next 90 days, believe it or not. So I want you to have that pitch perfected so that we can uh, publish our virtual uh, master marketplace book, How to Pitch Like a Pro. So one more time, Bruce, will you repeat that, your pitch, please, so that they can see a really clear example. And he's worked on this. Y'all have heard him. <laughs> yeah, it's brand new. Just never tried it before. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, it's great. It's great. Go ahead. All the elements are there. So now y'all right. listen with those things in mind. Are you living your life to the fullest or just existing? Stop. That's his hook. Okay, that's his hook. You want to have a hook so people will lean in and listen. Go ahead. Hi, my name is Bruce Barnes. I'm a mindset and wellness expert. I empower heart-centered people who want to improve their overall well-being and are ready to make the changes required to move towards their ideal life by using my courses, coaching programs, and technology that help you to actualize your full potential. Hashtag full potential. <laughs> okay, so he gave us his target market who he's looking for. And that's, we worked on that during our mastermind session. And we're going to work on that again next month in our mastermind session, because we really need to get that drilled down. When you come into these virtual marketplaces, we need to know exactly who is your target market. Not everyone, 
So let's, let's focus on the rifle approach and not the shotgun approach. And one of the things I said, are you using, uh, you know, a grappling hook? Are you using magnetic marketing? You want to be able to attract the right people and repel the wrong people to your business. So great thank job, Bruce. Thank you for that example. Well, thank you. Thank you. This is also just for everybody else and all, especially the new people. So when we're talking about hashtag, that's just a quick way for you to find that in the chat because you'll be able to save the chat later. So that's yes one clear. one of the things that we we do and again we're a little bit out of practice here at the end on your call to action this makes it very quick like bruce says for example mine is hashtag show me the money so i can quickly go down through all the chat and anybody who's interested in what i have to offer that day they will have typed hashtag show me the money so i know to reach out to them and then later you can do the follow-ups with everybody else to meet them so everybody in the group needs to work on coming up with a short succinct uh, hashtag that would identify you and you can change it over time and like i said we've been practicing our pitches they change from week to week sometimes you know the offers change and all of that and, and you will evolve so don't worry about getting it right the first time this is a safe place for everybody to practice. And for the newbies, don't think I'm being critical. That's my job here. And everybody else you'll find out next week when you come and bring your elevator um, pitches, we will give you some constructive criticism. You get to practice and coaching and all of that. And it's a lot of fun. So I'm just trying to get people back on, on the same uh, page. Marsha, would you like to go? Oh, one more thing. And notice that he told how he did it he told you what kind of programs that he offers because sometimes we're clueless we're just saying who we are what we do and we don't know you know what do you what do you have what kind of products or services do you offer so go ahead marcia thank you have you aged these past 14 months lost your youthful zest my name is marcia lacour and i am the ageless advocate as the author of four books, I love to guide entrepreneurs like you to thrive to 95, to remove the weight, reduce stress, and deal with cravings with my online programs. How can I help you? Go into the chat and put in hashtag ageless. Wow, new pitch for you too. And that was another fantastic one, Marsha. <laughs> great job thank you Val, Val Beer, we've missed you can't wait to learn about what you learned at your conference thank you I've missed you guys as well it doesn't Fridays don't feel the same um okay so um my name is sorry rewind <laughs> you, you've heard this before so I'm going to try and perfect this are you a woman who is stuck in a situation and looking for a way out my name is Balbia Pabila, and as a woman who had nowhere to turn, I was able to get out of my situation. When I, when I was introduced to Legal Shield, what I realized was two things. I didn't have to stay in the abusive situation that I was in, and I also got opened the door to the opportunity. And so I'm really passionate about making people, especially women, don't ever feel like how I felt. My mission is to empower as many women as I can along my journey to provide opportunity and environment to build their belief and confidence, step into their greatness and power, control their lives, create choices and live a purposeful life. So who do you know that may be or suspect that are going through something similar or want to looking to take control of their lives? Message me below and let's chat. Please write Legal Savvy with Balbir. Thank you. Fantastic, Balbir. Uh, this is a new one for her as well. And what I've noticed now that she has done that is extremely powerful is she is using the power of story to draw you in to her story. This is another technique that we talk about. So well done. Well done. Stevie, welcome back. Hope you're practicing, uh, getting ready for that next level up on your Toastmasters competition. Thanks so much, Nancy, I appreciate it. Who here grew up knowing they wanted to be a business owner? 
how about a salesperson? I did. I knew I always wanted to be both. And I started going door to door selling Krispy Kremes. My company is succeeding with Stevie and I'm Stevie, your beyond six figure sales coach. And I want to help you build a business that is beyond six, fig six figures and a lifestyle to match. My offer today is a 90 minute, $90 business planning strategy session. Please put hashtag beyond six figures in the chat. Well done. Thank you, Kate. Oh, she can't, she can't go. Okay. <laughs> I did that on purpose. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I want to wipe all that out because I've been rewriting and rewriting and I, I, I'm not done yet. So well, that's okay. So you wanna... does anybody, anybody actually realize, and no, of course you do, that beauty is not just skin deep. And did anybody know here that you actually only have seven seconds to impact and people see color even before style? I help busy entrepreneurs to show up their best online and offline without decision fatigue by harmonizing them with the colors that they choose to wear and knowing why they're choosing the colors to increase their visibility, their impact, and therefore their income. And because beauty isn't just skin deep, we actually raise the bar on health as well to support you from the inside out and the outside in. Hashtag color me beautiful. Well done. Thank you. Thank you. Priscilla Rose. <clears throat> Hello, everyone. <clears throat> I'm Priscilla Rose from Legal Shield. Now, did you know that if you drive out of your own state and receive a moving traffic violation, that you may have to travel back to that state to appear in traffic court? Well, if you have Legal Shield, you will be provided with a traffic attorney who will represent you in court so that you will not have to appear in person, saving you time and extra traveling expenses. Now, wouldn't that give you peace of mind? Now, I would love to talk to you and give you more information about the incredible services that Legal Shield provides. Because with Legal Shield, you will worry less and live more. And my hashtag is know your rights. Okay. Great job. Again, another example of what, how you could use your pitch. She gave an example of something that we might not have ever even thought about. You know, some of us I know due to COVID or whatever, you know, may not be able to travel, but many people do not know that about uh, what, what could happen. And that could save you a bunch of time and money. So if you have a business where you can talk about somebody, uh, an incident or something like that, it's great to add that to your pitch. So good job. I love the variety and uh, how we are bringing all these things that we're learning into your pitch. It's so important. Mary, would you like to go next? Sure. Hey, guys. Um, so I'm going to try something new today. So I want to say, are you feeling confuddled, confused, or lacking emotional clarity in your life? Are you feeling uh, conflicted regarding an inner life decision or uh, needing to find your inner voice? Um, allow me to help you. My name is Mary, and I am the co-author of the upcoming book, Be in the Conversation Around Mental Health. I'm an integrative medicine doctoral student based out of Toronto, Canada, and I am providing guidance in how to bring mental health back into the conversation. Um, I provide services such as energy healing. I'm a Reiki master teacher. I'm a yoga teacher, and I work as an intuitive, emotional sort of guidance counselor. Um, I can provide you ongoing coaching services in the form of uh, Reiki energy work or like tarot card readings. Um, is there a problem plaguing you? Are you needing to find your inner voice? Um, allow me to help you find that voice and speak out to get your needs met. Um, please reach out to me through the hashtag be in the conversation. Uh, thank you. Good job, Mary. Good job. Thanks. Michelle. 
Oh, so hi, everyone. I've missed you all. Um, okay, so just as Marsha was alluding, um, a lot of us have felt the stress and the aging effects that the last 14 months has brought on us. And a lot of us have found ourselves working from home, as well as even if you were working at home beforehand, now you don't have the coffee meetings and everything else that we're used to. So you really have a, a positioning that's creating this really heavy, um, unvital, like locked up space as lockdown is, is a good term for it. And, um, and so what I am providing is an optimized system to help your lifestyle create vitality and, um, and peacefulness, because a lot of us are feeling that overwhelm uh, in a, a new ecosystem in your home. So it's a work from home uh, habit performing system and hashtag master habits. All right. I believe I've got everybody. Let's do a screenshot right quick. Let's I'm going to do a countdown. Three, two, one. Look in your camera and smile pretty. Three, two, one. All right. So. We've got several opportunities since we went around. I uh, want to tell you about them again. One, tomorrow there is an elevator pitch class from one of our pollination partners. Next Friday at our Lunch and Learn Zoom Friday, we will spend the whole time practicing our elevator pitches and offers. And I've already told you, bring a 30-second pitch, an irresistible offer, and a hashtag. So that's going to be from 1130 to one. We uh, are so excited to bring to you some new cross pollination events. And this is something that we're going to probably start out quarterly and move to a monthly event. And I'm thrilled to death uh, to be able to do this. So we are looking for other networking groups to cross pollinate with. So that's going to expand our network exponentially, guys, over time. It's going to be amazing. So this particular one that we're doing on Friday, and I apologize, but please know that, you know, some people are in different time zones, so we're going to have to give and take a little bit. Not everybody's going to want to conform to our time slot. We hope they will, but, but not everyone will. So this one is going to be after our Lunch and Learn next week. So... What I'm thinking is tomorrow, if you could come to the pitch class to kind of get some tips, if you need help there, then come to Lunch and Learn Zoom Friday to practice and we'll give you some feedback so you'll be prepared to go right into the networking for the elevator uh, pitch networking. And it's going to be, um, there's, is it three? There's three of us plus one so it's it's us and three other networking groups make sure that I've got that and they uh, you know we're expecting over 100 people and there could be more so I do need your help to get that out to get that post out to more people it's going to be fantastic and I hope this is going to be the first of many many successful cross-pollination events does anybody have any questions on that or what to expect I do Okay, go ahead. Just, okay. I, actually, I want to know what time the event is tomorrow. Let's you said there was an event tomorrow. Yeah, I'll, I'll have to look and, and I don't have that up on my screen right now, but okay. I will post it for you. Awesome. So, okay. So Nancy, uh, next Friday's event, then uh, do you know what the format is going to be? Is it going to be similar to what Blaney's thing was where we're moving from table to table type thing or just a Zoom? Uh, Breakout. No, I, I think it's going to be Zoom breakout rooms. Their um, emotional intelligence is going to be their um, focus area for their featured speaker. And then each one of us is going to bring uh, an exercise like mine is create. So our breakout room for our networking for us will be creating. And I can't tell you what it is because I'm not allowed. But anyways, each one of them, there'll be a connect. So there'll be like five sessions and exercises for us to network together using these new techniques. So I think it's going to be really super cool. And um, awesome. I, I really hope that everyone will, you know, it's free. So come have some fun and, and you know, learn some new techniques because we all need new tool, tools in our toolbox. Marsha, I apologize. I see your hand up. Did you have a question? Okay. That's been up for a while, Marcia, just in case you didn't know. 
which which hand where you, you've got a hand in the reactions just click on on the hand that's like this and it'll take it down <laughs> i have a question questions are two for 99 cents kay but oh, i'll give her. you a deal <laughs> so you you said that this um co-network event is next friday at 11 30 but also next friday no okay so next friday at 11 30 is our referral partners meeting oh. 11 30 to 1 practice pitches and then where when is the I believe it's 1 30 central standard time but I'm gonna I'm gonna yeah. verify it's, that yeah it's 11 it's 1 30 central not standard daylight time people uh, <laughs> but, yeah. but anyway it's just what it's 11 30 pacific time yeah so 1 30 on central time okay thank you for clarification yeah. Uh, so ours is 11.30 to 1. We have a half hour break and then we go where yes. we need to yes. go. And you'll be putting out a link. Yeah. yeah. I, okay. I didn't I didn't want to um, uh, cancel our lunch and learn because I thought maybe it would be really good for us to get in there right before to really practice and 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 you know kind of give you some confidence and all of that before you go into a big, big group like that. I need all the help I can get. I just want all of y'all to know when if you're in my breakout room, you need to like pour it out because I, I need that help. I'm not a pitch person. Well, that's all right. That's what, fun. that's, that's it. That's it. And Kay, uh, we're gonna, Kay, you, oh. Kay, you've been doing a really great job. Yes, the yes last you have. While. You really have made some shifts. So kudos on you. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's amazing if I, I encourage you go back to our lunch and learns a year ago. Yeah and view those videos and then look at yourself now i know some people don't like to do that but let me tell you what every week i go back and review our video just to see you, you know and and i mean it's been remarkable uh the changes and the shifts and the confidence levels that you guys have have uh had so anyways um let's go ahead and move on let's talk about our kudos celebrations recognition and any testimonials. Uh, visitors, this is the time where no matter how small or big uh, anything that you would like for us to celebrate, this is the time where you can talk about yourself. So brag on yourself, brag on somebody else in the group, whatever it is that you want to do. Because one of the things that happens is sometimes uh, not everybody has a fantastic week. Not everybody's Nancy Fantabulous and, you know, is happy all the time. I realize that. So what you have to do sometimes is come in here on Friday to get you a little inspiration, a little kick in the butt, whatever else that you need to uh, get you through the rest of the week. And so this is a time that we can do that. It's inspiring. It, it's challenging. It really does. Uh, it's wonderful. So Jessica, since you mentioned that earlier, you teased us a little bit. You want to you wanna share something about yourself? Yeah, so I had the greatest call on Monday this week. I had a call from a client and um, our virtual assistant program is doing a bunch of work, not just for him, but for other, of, for other of his clients. So he's almost using us like a white label. And one of the clients, and I didn't know this, I mean, I knew it was a tequila company, but um, one of the clients is a tequila company. And uh, I found out on Monday when he called, the first thing he said out of his mouth was, I need you to know how grateful we are for everything that you and your team are doing. And like, I, I have to tell you, it was hard for me not to get choked up because when you start your Monday that way and a client calls to say, really, I'm calling for three reasons. One, to tell you how amazing you are, to let you know that because of the work you're doing for us with this client, they have, so this tequila company is a $240 million company. I didn't know that. And have they have handed the entire marketing project to the client because of the work that we're doing. And that's what he told me. And um, he was able to negotiate some things in the contract that I'll just say are amazing. And all I'll say about it is he chose to include me personally in that negotiation. And he did not have to do that um, in a very special way. And he is opening me up to another big um, international opportunity that um, we'll be having meetings with the founders and the CEOs soon. So it was just 
amazingly fantastic. So um, I just wanted to share that. I love it when we're doing brilliant things for the people that I love and care about. And I don't just care about him because he's a client, he's paying us, but I become really involved in our customers, you know, journey and their success and everything that we're they're, they're up to, to make the world a better place. So for me, that was very personally um, fulfilling, you know, it's, it's kind of why I do, why <laughs> I show it. up, you know, so yes. I'll, I'll mute myself now, but it was no, really fantastic. Right. Uh, I want to give Gary Sizemore some kudos uh, you know, Livy and I, since this is our anniversary month, uh, she and I have been, you know, constantly trying to figure out how we can bring more value to you and to help you more with your businesses. And what was interesting is she told me that uh, Gary has been working with her and has opened up some new possibilities and educated her on some options that she had never even considered or thought that she was eligible for. And so I encourage you, if nothing else, and uh, spend some time with Gary, and it, it may not be for you, but it certainly will open your eyes to some avenues for maybe other people in your network, spheres of influence, that type of thing. So Gary, you've obviously done a terrific job. She has just been thrilled to death with uh, working with you. So, so thank you for that. Anybody else have any testimonials or, uh, oh, one more thing that I want to uh, share. Hang on just a second. Um, you know, I do these one-on-ones, 15 minute one-on-ones and, and sometimes up to 125 uh, a week, you know, that I'm meeting new people to try and bring into our tribe. And uh, this past week, Olivia had introduced me to someone that he's going to be a guest speaker. And I, I got this book in the mail and I thought it was really interesting. And I, I thought I had it sitting here. But what I loved about it was, uh, and this is customer service, folks. He, he sent me this book. And anybody who knows me knows I have this wonderful library filled with thousands of books. And yes, I read them, okay? I am a personal and professional development junkie. And inside it, what I loved, it wasn't his book, but he had some uh, book markers that had his marketing material on there and a thank you note. So something very simple like that, even just a thank you note with those bookmarkers would have been, you know, wonderful, but we don't get mail anymore. You know, it's all about thank you text and, you know, uh, emails and all that other kind of stuff. So if you want to excite and delight the people, you know, think of something outside the box to do. And I, I want to go ahead and give a little teaser. It was about magic. He is a business consultant, but he uses magic. And so on his stuff, it had like a magic wand and what was interesting is uh, I practiced magic when I was a kid. <laughs> so that really got my attention. So anyway, something like that, that you can do when you meet people to make a good impression, uh, figure out ways that you can do that. So who, who was it? I apologize. Somebody else wanted to share? Marsha. Uh, so I just finished the first draft of my fifth book. Wow. And uh, it's about weight loss. So thank you. Wow, amazing. Wow, congratulations. congratulations Marcia. So Congrats, Marcia, Marcia, do you have now like, uh, ha have you put a package together where like you could get all five of your books at one time? Or have you considered that? Uh, no, I haven't, but I'll consider that. Yeah, I think, you know, buy one you know, for this price, three for this price and the whole enchilada plus some coaching for this. Just a suggestion. <laughs> Congratulations. Nice That's nice a nice one. Yeah. yeah. Unbelievable feat. Priscilla. Are they all, are they all, sorry, go ahead. Have a quick question, Marsha. Yeah, go ahead. Do you, um, are they all hard copy? No, they're soft. Um, let me see. Are they Kindle? Are they, um, I think two or three of them are Kindle on Amazon. And okay. the four that I have are all soft cover. Oh, so they're actual paper books. Yes. Yeah. Okay, Did you cool. Hard cover? No, no, no. I was just asking if they were paper. I, I meant to say, I should have said, are they all available on Kindle Physical. or are they blah, blah, blah. Physical books. That's Physical a, books. Much, there you go. Much easier. Physical or digital <laughs> or both. There yeah. you go. Yeah, Nancy, it was Mary Long that was wanting to share too. Okay. I'm sorry. Mary, go ahead. Hello. Thanks, Bruce. Um, 
Sure. Yeah. Congratulations to you, Marsha. That's amazing. Um, I have, so celebrations, what I want to share, uh, I have just co-authored a book called Be in the Conversation. It's around mental health. And uh, we're doing that as a joint project. Uh, there's about 12 to 15 authors based out of mostly Toronto, Canada. Um, and that book will be launching next month. So we've begun our sort of media circuit and interviews. Uh, I had a, I was on, I was featured on an interview this past Sunday called The Sit Down with Scott Dion Brown. And uh, we did a big feature about, again, finding your inner voice and specifically dealing with some of these issues around toxic masculinity and sort of seducing the ego and addressing some issues with mental health among the male population and uh, looking into video gamers and these sort of um, <clears throat> gamer techie types, how we can break down some of the, the barriers to the taboos and the stigmas that are around mental health, dealing with some of these issues of hate speech and cultivating a more loving and benevolent voice towards not just others, but also oneself. And so that was what my chapter was about. So we've just authored that book and it'll launch next month. And I'm really excited because that's the first book I've ever written or co-authored. And um, it represents a lot of changes, like just sort of coming out of these secrecy and shadows. Um, I was so nervous to be of this engineering background. I was so nervous to be public and be on stage and be a really outwardly ex um how do you call it? like uh extrovert extrovert yeah i i don't identify with that uh, as you, a title you, you got that you <laughs> you say that all the time but you always yeah. do you always do just do just fine okay Thanks, um we're we're gonna go have to uh two more uh priscilla and angela you got your hands up so we'll get through those but we got a lot to cover today go ahead priscilla okay <laughs> yes um i would like to give kudos to olivia for uh, working with me on LinkedIn. <laughs> so um, she really opened up my eyes to LinkedIn and that, that platform. And that's a platform that you can use that where I can really, you know, network and ex explain, expand my business. And with working with her, I even know now how to give my information for LinkedIn. <laughs> so when you look in the chat, at when you see the chat, at the end, you'll see my LinkedIn address. So I am so like glad that you mentioned her. that, Priscilla, because I want everybody right now to open up their tab of LinkedIn because we're going to have a little exercise here in a minute. So if you haven't already done so, I believe I put that in the email that I sent to everybody to get prepared for today. So make sure that you have your LinkedIn uh, page open. So thank you for that, Priscilla. Angela? Um, it's a bit of a testimonial, but I just wanted to thank Claudio and Val Beer, who both reached out to me. Claudio and I actually know each other from a previous professional development group that we were in. And Val Beer just reached out to me. She just felt a connection. And I was new last week and I really felt welcome. So I wanted to share that, I guess, as a testimonial of who they are as people, just to reach out and chat and really connect as human beings. And I really enjoyed getting to know them. So thanks for reaching out and making me feel welcome. Wonderful, wonderful. We all love to hear that for sure. All right, let's see here. Uh, a little announcement. We have been talking about how uh, philanthropy is part of our core values. And so we're really going to get hot and heavy on that beginning next month. So here's what we need from you. Each week, I would like to spotlight and invite anybody that you deem would be a great fit for us to come in and introduce their nonprofit club organization or something that they're doing to make a difference in this world and this can be at the local level national level state level whatever I do not care but we need to get introduced to some nonprofits and then we will vote as a tribe as to you know quarterly who we want our money to go to for that quarter's donation to charity. And it does not have to be a nonprofit. I'm just saying Excuse that. But somebody is not on mute. Uh, but anyways, I think this is gonna be exciting. This is gonna get us introduced to, to learn what's out there in the world, who's making a difference. Because we say 
we want to make a difference. But what are we really doing? You know, boots on the ground. We want to walk the walk and talk the talk. So we want to support organizations and people who are doing great things. So please start introducing me to send them my way and we will get them in. They'll have about five minutes. And, and I got this off of a group that I'm involved in here locally called 100 Women Who Care. Every 90 days we meet, <coughs> excuse me, and they get about three minutes to pitch and tell us about their organization, what they would use the money for. And then 100 of us vote. We throw our $100 in the kitty and uh, they walk away with the money that night. Simple, no big deal. It's great and everybody can afford it. So we have donated, Olivia and I, a portion of all the proceeds that come in uh, through anything that we do here. And so we have some money available and we wanna start doing that. Yes, Bruce. I was just gonna, just gonna uh, point out that our, one of our own Eagles, Ellie Sheffy, just recently launched her nonprofit for helping youth. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate that. Okay. So we've got that out of the way. Uh, featured speakers, we're still looking for life enrichment, personal and professional development speakers. I have July 23rd open, August 20 and 27th. So if you know anybody that would be a good fit for us, please send those to us. Uh, let's see here. We have, uh, let's go into announcements right quick. We have a new Facebook group. What we've learned is nobody's looking for Lunch and Learn Zoom Friday. What they're looking for is networking for entrepreneurs. So we've started a new group for that. And for all of us to be there, that will be an open public group. If you have not already joined that group, please do so on Facebook. We all have grown over the last year and lots of things have changed. And so I have a new referral partnership survey that I would like for you to fill out to kind of get me back on track with where you are as a business, what you're looking for, what are some areas that you're struggling. So this will help us plan for the upcoming year. I put that in the chat. We've got uh, thank you to all of those of you who uh, took advantage of the $99 founders membership special that we put out there. I'm not sure that everybody totally understood what we were doing. We were offering $99 membership for you to extend no matter what your date was for your membership. We're giving you an extra 12 months added on for only $99 as a thank you for joining us early. So that's what that was all about. So I wanted to okay, say that. that. that okay, that that was a little confusing because I thought that that had to do with our group. And I had, I think, just renewed my membership a couple months back. Okay. I'll, so. I'll, I'll get with you on that. That okay. was, you can add, you can add 12 months on for $99. I didn't, even know, didn't even know that there was another group. No, no, no. It's our group. She just saying, no, she's just saying that we have another Facebook group for our group to be in. Oh, yes. Instead of the Lunch and Learn Zoom Friday group, I'm going to try and migrate everybody over to uh, the new one, because I think when people are searching online for networking groups for entrepreneurs, those are the key words that they're looking for. So mm -hmm. I'm going to try and get everybody off of the Lunch and Learn Zoom Friday group oh, I see. to this one. I thought you were starting another whole group. No, 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 no. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Thank, like, thanks for bringing that up. Like, somebody. What? No. But the, the $99 is just to extend your current Meet My Referral Partner membership for 12 months. I'm not sure that doesn't include the co-op part. No, it's just no. The base, base yeah, just membership. the base membership. Yes. Okay. Because I just did that like I think a month ago. Yeah. I just wanted to clarify because I've gotten okay. several people to reach okay. out to me to find out uh, about that. Okay. And then. Um, Thanks. For this one year anniversary, we are, you know, still in the planning process over where we want to be. We've grown, we've changed. And so uh, one of the things is we really need to focus on growing our businesses and we need to have a way to track that. So let's 
think about what are the skill sets that you would like to learn for this upcoming year. This will help us bring in the right guest speakers and the right topics and all of those things. So if you have something that you want to learn about, please right now, if you would put that in the chat, anything that you can think of, and it doesn't matter, you know, if it's social media, uh, you know, marketing, whatever, CRMs, I mean, it can be as, as tight as you want, but we need to get inside your head to find out what it is that you would like for us to bring forward for the upcoming year. Next, um, we'll be discussing the books that you're reading. When you're reading books, we want you to come in here. I'm going to give you time to share a nugget. You know, this is important because a lot of times we don't have a lot of time to read. I personally devote a lot of time to personal development, but not everybody does. So if we can just take a nugget or two, something that you've learned and how you can apply it to your business, if you will bring that in here this week to share, and put that in the chat as well as verbalize it, I think this is really gonna be beneficial to kind of help us elevate one another uh, in a greater way. Same thing with any training courses that you've completed. If you've gone to a conference, if you've gone uh, you know, to a workshop, again, when you come in, don't just tell us that you attended that workshop, give us some nuggets, give us some takeaways that you learned so that we all can learn from your experience. This is one of the things that I want to add a little bit later on in our co-op. I want us to put some money towards going to these big moneyed events and then bring it back and have like a workshop to teach each other what we learn. There's no sense in all of us paying $5,000 a piece to go to a conference when one of us could go and bring it back and teach the others. And then that way our, our knowledge level will grow even further. Um, if you have any recommended organizations or anything like that that you think that we should know about, bring those on. Uh, the next thing is I wanna talk about the connect portion. We're all about connect partner and profit. So we're gonna start keeping track. And as far as networking, some of you are networking yourself to death but you're spending a lot of money and you're spinning your wheels and you're not getting much return on that investment. So I want you to start tracking the number of networking events that you're attending, how many attendees are there, what's the dollar amount that you spent, figure out your cost per lead. And I know some of you aren't math nerds. This is not about being a math nerd. You need to make sure that you're leveraging your time and your money so that you're getting the most bang for your buck. Some of it is about building relationships. So for example, if you go into an event, you spend $30, there's 30 people there that you don't know. $30 divided by 30 people, that's $1 per, right? So the cost per lead is $1 each. But what if you go to that same event and you know 15 people and there's only five people that are new. So your cost per lead has changed. However, we can't really put a dollar amount to building relationships. Just like our tribe here, week after week, we can shut our eyes and somebody can talk in this group and we can identify who you are because we know you, we have a relationship with you. There's something to be said about that. So I'm not wanting you to discount that, but I'm just wanting you to start thinking more like a business owner, the bottom line results, because we do need to work on our profitability. Um, your sales, how many sales you're getting, how many sales that you're getting per client, because it's easier to upsell your client than it is to go get a new client. So make sure over the next couple of months, we're going to be talking about sales funnels and how you can do that. Not everybody here is eligible for that. Not everybody's business is, but many of your businesses are. Yes, Bruce. Just to expand on that, it's not only upselling your current clients, but also asking your current clients for referrals. Yes. And we're going to get in that on the next portion, which is your uh on that connect part. Oh my goodnesses. So 
when you have a new connection, you need to have, and we can get with Jessica on this with her, and, and I'm, I'm guilty. I've got to get a system in place. If you don't have a system in place, you're really missing the mark. You need to set your business up. Uh, like Gary says, I don't care whether you're a franchise or not. You need to set your business up like it's a franchise so it can run without you. And one of the things is you need to have all this stuff automated. You need to have so they don't fall through the cracks. Okay. What happens when you have a new connection? There's all kinds of social media. How are you capturing that data? How are you following up the different touch points? That's important to build in that relationship. Next, we need to make sure that we are all connected across the social media platforms. So with that said, right now you have your LinkedIn profiles open. I want each one of you to drop your link to your profile in the chat right now because we're going to be having a LinkedIn posting party next week or the week after. And I'm going to send you specific directions on how we're going to do that. Jessica, I'm going to get with you on this. This is not uh, an advertisement. Let me explain how this is going to work rather quickly while you're putting your uh, post in there. What you do is you have a I believe, let's see how many characters that we need on that. Hold on, can I ask quickly a quick question about the LinkedIn? Do you want our personal profiles or yes. our business profiles? Um, probably both. Probably both would be good because we need to connect with you personally as well. Um, I believe there's, I believe it's 1300 words I'm trying to, or characters. I had it wrote down. Anyways, what you do is you, it's almost like a little article, something to entice somebody to come and, and see more about you. And what we will do is we'll prepare this in advance and I'll give you specific directions on what to do. We'll come together as a group and then we will share each other's post and like and comment. And what that does is that helps bring your profile up in the algorithms of LinkedIn. And so your irresistible offers will go in a comment. It will not go in that information. You're trying to introduce yourself in a way that's gonna entice somebody to want to read your article and learn more. And these have been very, supposedly, I'm hearing really great things when people are doing this. And it could take you all week long to do it. You don't want to just go in there and go bam, 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 bam. You know, you want to be uh, thoughtful with your responses on how you do that. But I've been seeing tons of people taking advantage of that. So um, the first thing here that I want you to do is put your LinkedIn information here throughout the week, go into this chat session, make sure that you're connected with everybody here. I have created today a new LinkedIn group that I want you to join, and it is Meet My Referral Partners Networking for Entrepreneurs, and I believe I put that in the chat as well, so make sure that you're in that group so that you'll get the uh, information and the invites on when we're going to have that posting party, and again, I am going to be connecting us with other groups who are doing this so that we'll be able to expand our network even further. But to get prepared for that, I want everybody connected on LinkedIn and in that group. Everybody clear on that? All right, the next thing that we can do, uh, and I've talked to Jessica about this and, and me and her are gonna work together, but Clubhouse is another one. Not everybody's interested in joining on that. For some of us, Olivia uh, kind of teased me a little bit. She said, oh, Dancy, you're going to love this clubhouse. This is just like how you grew up. You know, she's a young whippersnapper. And I said, what do you mean? She said, it's like a party line. It's like everybody comes in and you're all talking on the telephone. It's really neat. Nancy, you're going to love it. But it rolled out only as um, for the iPhones. And they now are rolling it out slowly for Androids. So. Anybody in here who has an invite available, it's only invitation only. 
and uh, they only give you one, and then I think they upgrade it. They're trying to slowly roll it out for the Android users. So if you would like an invitation to Clubhouse, we're going to do the same thing. Jessica's going to help, and we're going to do a little tutorial. We'll probably go play one day on Clubhouse during our Lunch and Learn to get everybody, but you need to have an account, and it's free. But if you need an invite right now, put that in the chat. If you have an invite, uh, put that in the chat available so that we can connect one another so that everybody can get on that wants on. Yes, Jessica. I think it's going to be from what I heard last and it could be different. Um, Android is going to be another, it could be anywhere from three to six months. It, it could be longer. So what I did was, cause I'm an Android user and I'm, well, not I'm on there. No, it's on now. It's on just, now. Oh, yeah. is it on now? Yes. Yes. But they're okay. only giving us, you know, they're only giving us like one invite. And now I think I might have well, three additional ones. I just went and got an iPad and used my Wi-Fi in my house. And that's how I use it. Um, some things to know if you are going to play in the sandbox just to prep. The way you communicate with people on Clubhouse is you take it off the platform. So your live conversations are happening, are listening like a podcast. If you're just a little guest in the room, like a fly on the wall, um, are uh, in Clubhouse. But if you actually want to communicate with people, you need to, the most important thing, like any platform is fill out your profile 100%, make it look kicker and kick butt. Okay. Cause that's how you're going to get invited on other people's stages to speak. The second thing to know is you must connect these to your Instagram and Twitter accounts. That is how they're going to direct message you later and actually get with you and have calendar one-on-ones and getting to know you calls and really doing business with these people is with the LinkedIn and Instagram messages. So those are the, the really most important things to know. So, um, okay. So that. we're going to, we're going to real basic, we're going to yeah. level it down for you. It's, it's a really, believe it or not, it's a simple, simple platform. It's just you're sitting there. You can like lurk and just listen in on people's conversations. Listen. And we can have our own events. So we can have elevator pitch mm -hmm. sessions in there, you know, and it's 24 hours, seven days mm -hmm. a week, whoever you can go join anybody's group. It's just really kind of a unique thing. So we'll just play around with it. It may or may not be for you. But I just want to introduce that and let you know that we will practice it during our time here to get your feet wet. But let's get everybody on or invited that want to. Yes, Jessica. And last comment is because this is um, just a pure, if I don't say so myself, a pure act of genius <laughs> on my part again, because most people don't think about this. But um, I am uh, guiding my clients, anybody who is already doing some sort of regular weekly live. Are you live on YouTube? Are you live on Facebook? Are you just live weekly on a standard day and time with your clients? If you're doing that already, all you have, so Clubhouse is audio. It's all audio. Yeah. So you, yeah, you don't have to worry about your face. You don't have to worry about your virtual background. Nothing. But yes, but if it's you're just already, like talking on the phone. But hang on. The, the point here is if you're already going live, and you're on video and whatever, who cares? But put, say you're doing a clubhouse at the exact same time, because guess what? You're already talking. So your clubhouse weekly appointment is whenever your live is already going. And so you have people in that room and you can say, hey, you can join me a lot. I'm live on Facebook right now as we speak, or you can chat with me and you can say on Facebook and hey, guess what else? We're live in a clubhouse room. So if you'd rather join us there, jump on in. So you are just expanding and doubling your time. Yes, I am brilliant and you're welcome. So there you go. <laughs> and Nancy. Yes. Um, I did not have my clubhouse because I didn't understand the beginning process. And so somebody invited me before I got the email from clubhouse. So their invite didn't work. So before you ask somebody to invite you, make sure that you're set up and you've gotten that initial email from clubhouse laying out like, you know, blah, blah, blah. And once we receive an invite, we will notify you kind of thing. So Otherwise, huh. you put the cart before the horse and it doesn't necessarily work. Are you okay. saying that? So, Kay, are you saying that you need to go to Clubhouse and request something and then await someone's invite? What you do is you go in and you, you activate your Clubhouse account 
with your real name and the information that they ask. And then Clubhouse sends you um, a notification that they've received your information and your account is like being held waiting for that invite to come through. Once that invite comes in, they connect it to your account, then they send you an email and tell you you're in. Okay, so so bottom line is everybody needs to go to their phone and download the app. Okay, because it only works on the on your phone, it does not work on the computer. And then uh, one of us will sit here and um, double check before you invite somebody that way you don't use your invite or whatever. And uh, we'll send you an invite and mine come in a text and all I had to do was click it and then I was in. Okay. So let's not make this more complicated, but yep, good, good point. So go ahead if you want to clubhouse for Android or clubhouse for iPhone, whatever. Uh, so we've got that. Oh, and also uh, I'll be teaching a class that I'm gonna talk with Nancy about setting up the um, co-op as an affiliate. And so she'll share that link. It's coming up soon. I'm doing a collaborative class on question asking, the art of question asking, which you need when you do networking and, and especially when you're on Clubhouse as well as Clubhouse 101. So we're gonna be covering quite a bit of information um, and I'll make sure that we get Nancy's link out to the entire group later on. And we'll talk about that. Is that okay, Nancy? We chatted Perfect. about that a little bit. Yep. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. All right. Next thing is a uh, partner with referrals, cooperations, and joint ventures. And again, this is one of our uh, main components of who we are and what we do. So we want to start tracking this because I want to know what's going on out here. We all come in here and talk about how much business we're doing with each other, but we haven't had a mechanism to track this. So we want to know how many discovery calls that you've had with our members, how many cooperation opportunities, how many introductions to other referral partners have you made, how many purchases from other, now we don't need to know the dollar amount, purchases from other members, how many referrals have you given, and how about testimonials and reviews. It's all about accountability, and people will not respect what you do not inspect. That's something that I learned and I taught my uh, college professors when I was a director of education and it, it, it's true in business if you don't pay attention to the numbers you're never going to know really how you're doing you're just floundering out there so it's important that you connect with every single person in our group you need to start building that relationship if if you would like to buy something from them buy something I'm not saying you have to at all but if they have a product or a service we need to be buying it from our referral partners rather than outside our tribe because we want to help one another uh, succeed. So those are some things that you will be taking uh, advantage of. Also, under profit, uh, over the next few weeks, we will talk about key performance indicators. Each one of us is different, but we're all basically working as online entrepreneurs. So there are some key performance indicators that we need to be tracking to see how well that we're doing in our business. That's gonna help us catapult. That's gonna help us exponentially grow because once you start tracking those numbers, you're gonna see some things that you're like, oh man, that's terrible. Or, oh man, that's better than what I expected. And you're gonna be able to tie those right into your revenue and your profitability. You may have all kinds of sales, but if you're only making a penny off of every sale, it's going to take you a while to be financially independent, right? And the majority of us have that dream in our hearts that we want to reach financial independence. And the way that we do that is by building our wealth. Uh, let's see here. What else do we have? For uh, events, if you have any events coming up, post those in the chat right now. Again, on Tuesday, we have our co-op meeting, which means that we'll have a guest speaker talking about um, their, uh, you know, opportunities that they have available. We'll also be discussing our current projects, how well or not that they're doing. So that'll be Tuesday at 1130. We'll have our cross-pollination event that Friday, as well as our lunch and learn, where we're going to be practicing our elevator pitches. Anybody else have anything on... Uh, that they would like to talk about as far as their events, anything spectacular going on? I know I've given you a ton to digest today, 
<laughs> and I just figured I would go ahead and get it out in the open so you would know where we're going. The bottom line is we want to help you grow your business, not just in little bitty, teeny tiny bits and pieces. We want to help you grow your business exponentially in the quickest way possible. One of the things that we can do is um, on our last week's session on our mastermind, just to give you an example of how you need to be thinking, we was talking to Richard Morton about his business, and he was wanting to reach uh, women who were going through a divorce in a specific target market, specifically for these women who are going through a divorce. And so trying to find women who are going through a divorce might be a little bit time consuming, right? So who can know before, uh, is Gary still on here? Did he have to leave? I'm not seeing him. Gary came up with a great idea. And I just want to ask you out loud, what would you think if he's trying to find divorced women, instead of finding onesies and twosies, what might he do to find groups of women who are going through a divorce? Divorce lawyer. Amen, sister. Amen. Yeah, I think I, I already told him that weeks ago. Yeah, so did I don't, you? I don't well, know whether he I don't know whether he heard it or not. Probably not. Well, we you know, we were discussing and and I think that's great. And then let's let's move it a little bit further down Separation. the pipe. Down down the pot was okay. let's partner with these lawyers and include that in as part of their package for these women. So he would automatically get a client every time somebody filed for divorce and that that lawyer had, you know, you see what I'm saying here? Not just, oh, who do you know? Could you refer me to? Let's just put it as part of your package in that you're providing to these women for your services. So, so, you, man. Find, so you find a trustworthy heart centered lawyer because he, what he's doing is heart centered work. So you have yes. to have totally right energy for that. But if he partners with someone like that, it would be a natural collaboration and he would also be a lawyer that he could refer people to absolutely yeah. so these are the things that we want to teach you and we want to brainstorm together we have people in our tribe that are from all over the world you've had different experiences different backgrounds and you know two heads are better than one but 50 and 100 are even better so when we get together on these mastermind sessions and, and we really want to focus on that over the next couple of months to really help you drill down and, and you can have several target markets, but then also help you come up with really great, affordable, cheap, free ways that you can partner with other people. And then the next piece of that is cooperations. You know, who could you partner with like that and, and grow both of your businesses? So it's, it's going to be a really exciting year for us. And we really, I cannot wait to see what's going to happen in your businesses as well as how we're going to grow. Anybody have any closing remarks or would you like to discuss you that for your about, business? You asked about events and I was just going to say, I have a ton coming up. Several I'll talk to Nancy about getting affiliate links for the co-ops, but some of them are free even and everything from TikTok to YouTube to Clubhouse to LinkedIn classes to reducing operating expenses to the art of prospecting to we have a series of classes and some of them are free and some of them cost a very little amount. Um, but anything that costs something, I'll talk to Nancy so that the co-op makes money back through it so that everybody here makes money back through it. Right. Um, but uh, yeah, so I just wanted to say that. And then other idea for free stuff, you were talking about the lawyer thing. Um, also uh, podcasts on, you know, single parents and surviving divorce and relationships and communication. He would be great as a podcast guest for any of those kinds of things. So that's the other thing you guys should be thinking about um, doing. And there's a joint venture partnership opportunity with other podcast hosts also, because if you have an affiliate program or you can share a little of whatever with that podcast host, that's a revenue stream for them, as well as if you can provide a free gift for their community that makes them look a, like a hero. So think about what you can do for them when you're asking for those guesting opportunities. And, and uh, the other thing too, one of, one of the things we talked about last year that I want to get online this year is we want to have our platform where every one of you, if you have products, services, courses, and all of that stuff that you can also add them to 
our platform and we can promote that. And perhaps we want to consider doing that as a subscription program like other people are doing, but we have a wide variety of talent and expertise in this group and we really need to be leveraging that. So with this time, I would like to go around and ask the visitors about their experience today, if we didn't kill them and uh, see, see what they thought about their first time visit. Marta, would you like to share your thoughts with us? We hope you enjoyed yourself. Thank you so much. It's uh, amazing to be here and to see so many incredible people. Um, yeah, I, a lot of information. Um, and in terms of uh, anything that I offer, if anybody ever wants to join, I have morning classes, yoga, meditation, uh, ecstatic dance, mantra, definitely Kundalini yoga. So you can just email me. I'd be very happy for any of you to join any of the classes. And I didn't get a chance to share, but I was really excited that I had a group healing on uh, Monday and we raised over a thousand dollars to go a hundred percent to India to help the locals. So I just, <laughs> since I had an opportunity to share, I have all these Ab Absolutely. If you'll put that link in the uh, chat, we'd love to learn learn more about that. And just so you know, I, uh, I threw up on everybody today with a lot of information just because it's coming up on our one year anniversary. We typically have a, a guest speaker that comes in and gives us a professional development topic instead of Nancy Gaskin sitting up here and, and going through all that stuff. So I don't want to scare you off and think that that's what we do every single time. But we're just kind of kicking off our new year. And I just wanted to give um, our members the opportunity to kind of see the vision of where we're going, why we're doing it, and, and what we're doing. So, Deb, come on down. Nancy, thank you so much. Yes, this was um, delightfully overwhelming with information. And I want, and I want to know, do you have uh, some place or space where there's a calendar where we can access a calendar to see all the up and coming events, like something on Tuesday, then Friday, then Saturday? We do have an event page on our website and it probably needs to be updated now that we've added all of this stuff. And so I'll make sure that that gets done over the weekend. And okay. uh, that'll be on our meetmyreferralpartners.com website. Um, website, okay. And the other thing is, how do I register? Where do I go? Who do I see? Well, I don't know, folks. Do we want to let her in? Yeah, show, show Nancy the money, right? That's it. Show me the money. <laughs> the, same, the same thing. I'll show put me the, the money. I'll put the uh, link down here <laughs> in, the, in the chat. Shame on me for not putting that in. Angela, would you like to uh, say a few words? My husband's just in a meeting, but I just want to say what Deb said, delightfully overwhelming. I'm like, it's insane. I work with a lot of awesome people and I can see the, the energy and the information and the knowledge and the um, tenacity in this group is like pleasantly overwhelming. Awesome. Thank you. <laughs> I think, I think they're, they're not, not saying, saying nice things, but we get the message. I got you. <laughs> Anybody so now, else? So, so now, Andy, is that now that you've used your, your two free uh, visits and stuff, are you going to show Nancy the money? <laughs> she, she sent me one earlier already today. That she said she was ready yesterday. So I hope this just kind of cinched the deal. Well, we're, we're happy to have you. Claudio, go ahead. Yeah, I, I, I just kind of browsed through the chat. I couldn't find the, uh, the link you posted for the new LinkedIn group. Have you got that handy? Yes, I do. Please, and thank you. Uh huh. Awesome. Nancy. Yes. I'm showing you the money. I might oh, have the man. Come on. <laughs> oh, Angie, love Angie. it. Love it. <laughs> hey, welcome, Deb. There you go. And Angie. Right. Let me find y'all. Too and many. after all this info gets in there, everybody, do not forget to save your chat with all this great information and links here. I know Olivia usually reminds us about that. Yes, yes. And I had that down on the agenda. I had so much piled onto that agenda. It went to the second page, I noticed. So I didn't get a chance to uh, tell you guys to, to do that. So your homework for this week is practice your elevator pitches, get it copied and pasted. 30 seconds plus an irresistible offer 
and a hashtag. Next, make sure that you join our LinkedIn group, connect with everybody in here on that LinkedIn group so we can start preparing for our LinkedIn party, posting party. Directions will come in the form of an email that will tell you step by step what to do, how to do, and when we're going to do that. Um, let me think what else. I'll make sure that the co-op meeting and the events are put on the website over the weekend. So uh, we'll start keeping that updated a little bit better. We've kind of a little bit been overwhelmed. Anything else, Bruce? Do you have anything? No, this is uh, just Tony and Dean's um, event is just starting in a couple of minutes, but it's free. It's, just, it's free, it's, folks. And I'm telling yeah. you, it's fantastic information. I'm never disappointed. Yeah, so they, they've got some great tips that they've been sharing and, and I'm sure Nancy and I all re, you know share that <laughs> yes yes so. unbelievable Richard Brunson is there you know from click funnels and and all of that stuff and by the way I forgot to mention I missed y'all so much last week I can't believe it's the first one that I've I've missed in a whole entire year and I was having withdrawals I had no internet no cell phone and, and all of that stuff but it was really good so I needed that and if you'll notice you know I'm kind of back and I'm on fire <laughs> So, I am so the, all ready to go. So Nancy, the first few days of your trip, then you're kind of shaky or a little going through withdrawal and what? I know, right? <laughs> My whole family thought I was going to have a nervous breakdown. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Well, all right. Well, thank y'all for attending. I hope to see you again and y'all have a great weekend and I will see you soon. Thank you, Nancy. Great to see everyone. Have a great weekend. Bye, everybody. Have a wonderful weekend. I'll try to come in from Hawaii next week. Oh, yes. Oh, make sure you yeah. post Good lots of pictures. You. Safe travel. Five hours behind, but I'll try to make it in. That's amazing. Have a great time. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye. Oh, I love you guys. <laughs> oh, man. Stevie, what's going on? What did we do now? <laughs> First of all, I got to stop recording. <laughs>